Sip into the holidays with a splash of grape cheer. We're turning Santa's milk and cookie game upside down as we blend a fruit basket and your favorite red wine together. With this being the only fruit salad accepted at our holiday table this year, we hope it'll have your taste buds walking in a winter wonderland. Join us in the kitchen for a perfectly festive time and let the jolly times roll. Let's make it, taste it, and rate it. hustlers welcome back to the cocktail kitchen i'm so excited for you to be here uh today we have something a little bit more fun actually we're gonna make a christmas holiday sangria but we're gonna just make a half a recipe instead of a full one because i ain't throwing a party just yet but stay tuned uh but it's gonna be a lot of fun so in this we are going to need um a half an ounce of agave syrup then you're gonna need an ounce of your orange liqueur an ounce of a brandy of your choice a third a cup of ginger ale soda about a half of a bottle of red wine like a dry red wine would be best um and then you're gonna have like a fourth a cup of your pomegranate seeds here you're gonna half your fruit we're gonna make it look super super cute and festive so let's go ahead and hop right into making this cocktail okay so we're gonna take our cute pitcher here i just got this on amazon along with this bartender kit if you guys are interested i will leave the links to those down below in the description box it is linked to my store it is like an affiliate link so i will get just a little bit if you guys decide to buy um it helps us out a lot and keeps this channel going but you know I'm not here to strictly keep promoting everything so just wanted you guys to know that you could find this cute picture if you're interested um let's go ahead and do our half an ounce of agave and we're just gonna pour everything right into the pitcher here. So half an ounce of agave here. And then we are going to do an ounce of our orange liqueur. There's my ounce. Then we're gonna do an ounce of our brandy. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add just my fourth a cup of pomegranate seeds here. And then we're gonna go ahead and add our fruits as well. So again, just to make it cute, we're going to do a half of a lime. I'm just gonna do like some cuter lime wheels. And so that's about three lime wheels is really cute. That's good. And then we're gonna do half of a pear. Pick up from the bottom and I'll do some pear wheels. All right, that's about a half. We'll add that to the pitcher. And then we'll go ahead and do half of an orange. This, this is a big orange, so it should be good. Wonky looking <laughs> orange wheels. Oh my gosh, so I'm gonna add my orange wheels in there. It's about half of an orange. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just give this a little stir, just to kind of get those juices flowing down there. I know there's not much in there, but trust me. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add a cinnamon stick. If you're making the full recipe, it calls for two. But again, like I said, we're just making one. So I'm gonna add one cinnamon stick in there. Okay, so now we're going to open this lovely bottle of wine here. Ah, there we go. Okay, and we're going to do half our bottle of wine. All right, so we'll just finish spinning here. And then we're gonna let this chill for at least a couple hours. Um, you can serve it over ice most definitely, but the longer it sits in the fruit and has a chance to like marinate with the cinnamon and the flavors and stuff, the better it'll be. So I'm gonna go ahead and pop this in my fridge. And then when it's done, we'll be back. All right, so I have my glass here with my little fruit garnishes in there and I'm gonna go ahead and just put some ice 
right over the top there while I spill the ice over here, it's fine. And then I'm gonna go ahead and pour the sangria in. And it says about a third of a cup of ginger ale like actually in the sangria like cocktail, but I'm just gonna go ahead and add a splash of Sprite right on top there. Oh, that's just gonna be so good. And then we're gonna have our boo, our main woman, our sister from the same mister, <laughs> Tyler Bay come in and test this cocktail out for you guys. All right, get your little cutie thing on up in here. Ooh, 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 ooh. I know, I know, look doesn't that. it look so good? Nice. So it's a sangria. I actually am a huge fan of sangrias. I actually haven't had a lot of sangrias actually. Okay, <laughs> so, well, yeah. go right on ahead, okay. dig on up in there. Okay. <laughs> Tell me what you think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good, okay, <laughs> okay. I just like seeing all the ingredients, I was like, that's gonna be a lot. Yeah, Let's but say. then I don't taste it. Right. Because of the wine. Let's say. It's like a nice, like, it's like a nice gentle wine, honestly. It smells heavenly. Mm -hmm. It looks cool, like the garnishes and everything. I guess you can't really yeah. see them now with like the red wine all over them, but. The orange definitely comes through. Oh, yeah. it's not, no, not in a bad way. It's just like, my mouth wasn't ready for the citrus. <laughs> but it's good, like, yeah, it's yeah. a really pretty drink. Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> it's yummy, it's like, a, it's just, a, it's, a, I don't know what, like, I don't have a comparison for other sangrias, so okay. I'm just like, it's a nice gentle wine, like with some good flavors in there. Some fizz. Yeah, yeah, there's a little bit of fizz, not too much fizz. Oh, okay. I don't would actually, you, yeah. Would you like, want more like ginger ale fizz, less ginger ale fizz? It's I good, think it's like good. That, like, yeah. yeah. If you put more ginger ale in there, it's gonna um, dilute the flavor a little bit of yeah. the sangria. So I think it's really good. Yeah. I okay. could like, I picture like sitting by a fireplace, you know, yes. Christmas Eve or whatever, like drinking this and just hanging out, kind of dozing off, falling asleep. That's what show, I get. With your girls, mm -hmm. watching a little movie, a little holiday movie. A little. No. What is your favorite holiday movie? I like The Grinch. The Jim Carrey one. The J Jim Carrey Grinch is probably my favorite. Me too. <laughs> holiday <laughs> movie. Oh, I thought you were going to yeah. say something different. No. I the Grinch and the Santa Claus, mm -hmm. or Santa Claus, oh, is like, yeah. with the one with Tim yep. Allen, mm -hmm. right there yeah. for me. Like they go <laughs> neck and neck. That's so. probably like as a kid, I probably would have yeah, like Santa Claus a little bit more. But That's Grinch, funny. like I don't know, Grinch. Jim Carrey's just a funny guy. Yeah, Grinch is just this funny yes. character. So yeah. Let us know in the comments <laughs> below what your favorite Christmas movie is. But all right, what are you? I'd say like. Hanging with the homies, oh, you know, like cocktail party. Okay. okay. Why? Why not a cocktail party? I don't. Just not a wine girl. Oh shit! Look out! I just don't picture myself getting more than one of these. Cause this is big. It's big. I mean, that's <laughs> no, like, that's a glass. No, I'm not. Actually, I'm not getting a lot of this. Anymore. Okay. So I, yeah, it would Maybe be, it'd be interesting, yeah, to get a little bit more of that cinnamon -y flavor, okay. which would probably push it more towards the holidays. Okay. That. Okay. Yeah. Maybe if we just like dusted some on top of me, we let it yeah. set for like a little bit, but yeah, probably wasn't enough still. So I'd like to see maybe overnight yeah. and then put some ginger ale over it and stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So hanging with the homies. Hanging. With no. The homies. Okay, I was gonna say no. <laughs> no, because you're thinking about it. Uh uh. <laughs> Don't you just get on a chill no, cocktail party no. kind of night. Get, get out of here. <laughs> Whatever, apparently it's a 3.5. I'll take that. We don't do halvesies on this channel, but it's fine. It's a sangria. I personally enjoy sangrias. I, I don't think I've, no, that's a lie. I think I've had one bad sangria and it was from like a chain restaurant that probably shouldn't have been making sangrias anyway. So totally fine. But let me know in the comments below what you guys thought of this cocktail. If you guys are gonna try this cocktail, if you have another holiday, Christmassy, Thanksgiving, festive, sangria, or just any cocktail that you would like us to try, leave those in the comments below. 
And with that, we love you guys so freaking much. Always, always put good energy into your spirits. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we will see you in the next. Let's try a drink cocktail shot adventure. Love you guys. Bye. Uh, yeah, no, it's a nice, refreshing pair to the Lodkas, because the Lodkas are kind of heavier. I mean, mm -hmm. like we said, the zucchini house, but there's it's still heavy. It's a potato cake. So. Right. Thank you guys so freaking much for viewing the cocktail video just now. I really, really appreciate it. If you want more like this and you like the content that you've been seeing, don't forget to subscribe down below. Or if you want to watch the next episode, go ahead and click right over here. I will see you guys in the cocktail kitchen soon. Bye.